Hello, welcome again to Sandy Ainley. I don't mind saying uh, the reason I'm wearing this stunning, smashing, striking, whichever word you prefer, scarf is be as a result of the fact that I, a friend of mine placed oil in my hair today and I do not want so wish whichever word you like to use most in that context the oil to go all over the place so to speak so just to if i may clarify um i just so wish to um share something positive with each one of you positive number one this beautiful drink, blue. Positive number two, this beautiful drink, which has an orangey red color. <clears throat> and positive number three, beautiful drink, a type of a yellow color. I do not mind having clarified the colour of each bottle of drink. What I'm going to do is taste a little bit of each one and see if I like any of it. So if you bear with me, please, I shall open the first one. The first one is Pineapple and coconut flavour. This is Don Simon, this drink. And I'm just going to try a little begin, to begin with and see if I so wish to have more. Um, quite pleasant, for me anyway. Uh, the first taste I found at first a bit sweet, and then I really could f taste the pineapple part kicking in. I'm going to try again. Bear with me, please. Thank you. Yes, it is quite sweet. However, I like it. I don't mind having said. I probably shall have some more of this. I'm not going to close it too tight. I'm just going to have what I've had in this glass. What is left in this glass, I mean. Sorry. Excuse me, please. Sorry. Okay, so drink number two, lemon and strawberry juice drink. There we are. Don Simon drink. It's very mildly sparkling and I'm mean what I said. I say what I mean when I say very mildly. Again, pleasant. And sweet and not very sweet for me anyway I'll, excuse me please I'll finish it mm. 
And last but by no means least, the blue drink. Again, Don Simon. And it's lemon and raspberry flavour. Excuse me, please. Beautiful. Sweet, however, not too sweet and absolutely beautiful. I love it. Bateavon, one says in the Jewish, in the Hebrew language, which means good health to you. Um, I have a so-called sort of, not sort of, literally, I have a aftertaste which says to me that it, the drinks were very sweet much more than I initially thought and the reason I say that is, is as a result of the fact that the, the aftertaste I have right right now this very moment is of great sweetness and so I've changed my mind I'm not going to have more of any of the drink um, and I say drink it's, it's all soft drinks they're all soft drinks I meant sorry however um, um, going on to one more subject um, I don't know if you recall me having shown you a picture of a little child star if you can see the one above the ballerina, which is directly below the pink frame. That little girl who's sitting so beautifully on an armchair is a little girl who played the, the part of little orphan Annie in the show, in the professional show in the West End London of London at the Victoria Palace Theatre. The little girl was only of about 11 years of age and won the role um, against about, I think, 5,000 children. and got the part of the smallest orphan child in the show called Molly and the parents I disallowed the little girl Claudia Bradley's the little girl's name was the little girl's name and uh, the lady's an adult now and um didn't allow Claudia to play Molly however when Claudia was a bit older, the parents um, again allowed the little girl to go for an audition for the for Annie, and Claudia won the role of the main part, Annie. And as a result of the fact that Claudia was a little older at that point, uh, the parents allowed Claudia to play the role of Annie. And um, one day, little Claudia was given an, uh, a whole documentary on the subject of Claudia Bradley. And I so wish to say that 
I think it was Gordon. Gordon Bra. Oh gosh. Um. There was a gentleman who used to um, do a lot of interviews. Um, Melvin Bragg, I think. I think so. And I think this gentleman was the one who interviewed Claudia on BBC One in a documentary. If you are able to retrieve the detail could you kindly give the detail to me as to how to find Claudia's documentary stroke, interview stroke, documentary and interview? Because I can't find it and I'm very frustrated. I don't mind having said. That would be smashing. So on my positive ending, I bid you a very good night and please take lots of care. Please take care also of each other. Lots of love. Bye.